Hello, good morning. Um, okay, so this is going to be a little bit of a different thing, but, um, so I was car shopping all for like two weeks, and I have some other brochures, but I think I left them in my husband's other vehicle, and I think he actually took it to work today instead of riding his motorcycle. So I have pages of paper here. Oh, I'll just, I'll just show them like, here we go. <laughs> Um, so I got pages of paper. They are, uh, I'm just going to guesstimate with my 12 inch ruler. So my foot long ruler. So I'll just guess close enough. Anyway, I'll give better measurements when looks like, I guess, a either a foot and a half or I don't know, close to it. And then it's the standard, what, 11 inches. So, all right, so all those, let's see, there's three pages. Oh, and, yeah, there we go. So it's just a standard thing. So these are just regular pieces of paper. They're a thicker magazine paper. They're not as thin as magazine paper, but they are a magazine paper. So they might not paint well, uh, but... I wish I, I wish I I wonder if I could sand with some sandpaper and rough up the edges on these on the side I want to paint on and if that would make the paint not bubble or whatever anyway so these three pages are thin paper you know they're uh they're a thicker thick what's the word I want to look for they're a thick magazine paper then this one is the cover page um, and it's, I'd say cardstock thick, so that's good. And so, like I said, all three of, or hold on, <laughs> all four of these are this length, you know, booklet length. And then I have one page that had a pull out flap, so this one is this long <laughs> so I got one really long one and uh, other ones that are kind of semi long so anyway I'm gonna paint those today I think maybe today if it's gonna be nice today uh, so yeah I just figured I'd show you one of the projects that I do have sitting on the back burner I figured oh and then while I'm at it I might as well paint I've only, I'm only saving my pages that are thick for, um, they're thick pages for doing, uh, painted paper because I have so many other, you know, papers now that I don't need to keep like this one. There's another one. I thought about using this one because it uh it has a coupon for oh uh, let's see it has a coupon for a haircut for seven ninety nine. I don't usually get my hair cut so <laughs> so I had that one saved and I don't really have any more. So yeah. Um uh, that's what I'm I'm probably going to do here in a little bit. I don't want to get too involved in painting because I do have to leave in about an hour and a half. So I'm probably just going to uh, cut some more pages from this booklet. I've already used up this much, uh, if you can tell without my hands being in the way. I've already used that much of the paper pack. So... I am just super glad that I'm actually using these up. I do have a double-sided 6x6 six six paper, paper pack that's like this, and it has two sheets of each color, so I'm going to do one and one. Uh, I'll cut them up, and then I will do one one way, one the other way, just like I did with the... Uh, I don't have any right here. <laughs> I actually uh, did them all, but you know what? You know, the, the, the latest double-sided paper that I did. So, all right. Um, yeah, okay.